is on David Eldar. Action is on Chris Ferguson. And he gets out of the way. Our new player also decides to hold fire. And to Tom Dwan, we can barely even see his cards because he's got so many chips. Makes a raise for 2200. And to Andrew Feldman from the UK, full tilt professional poker player. He's got king, queen of clubs. And he makes the call, so two players to the flop. Both with similar hands, although crucially, Feldman is in front. One has Queen Jack suited in space. Two players, seat four and seat six. Action for seat six. And the flop is a king, queen, five with two spades. That is an action flop. Yeah. Very decent flush draw for Durr and top two for Andrew Feldman. Well, Tom Dwan trying to control the pot, betting 4,000. Over to Andrew Feldman now. Feldman actually checked to him when he was first to act. And now he re-raises, so a check raise there. That is going to set alarm bells ringing, even in the head of as fearless a player as Tom Dwan. And certainly won't like being check raised. Tom Dwan likes to control. And he calls, so we will see a turn card. Middle pair and a flush draw in Tom Dwan's hand. The turn, an eight of hearts. So Andrew Feldman still well ahead in this hand. Tom Dwan creeping up behind with a monster draw. I don't know if you know her. Feldman's been very quiet so far at this big cash table. She seems interesting. But now he comes out pumping. 26,000. 26,000. Tom Dwan now. We know Tom Dwan doesn't like to fold. We know he does have a monster draw. Oh, he's got a lot of chips. <laughs> yeah, he can't afford it. But, uh, he's such a good player. Does he want to put himself in a position? Yes, he does. He's going to try and get lucky. See the river. And the river is a two of diamonds, so Andrew Feldman will not lose the hand unless, of course, he folds. Can't see him really doing that from here. No, he's got to love that river card. It's a total blank. If he does put Dwan on the draw, he knows he's home and dry. Andrew counting out some chips and puts a lot in the middle. Sixty thousand. So if Dwan calls here, there'll be around two hundred thousand dollars and then remember that's real money not just chips in the middle and all he has is second pair well you haven't seen Tom Dwan too uncomfortable at this cash game he's had the better of it Gus putting his two pennies worth in <laughs> Andrew Feldman showing absolutely no signs just staring at the board Tom Dwan with very little to go on now he's thinking. He certainly does not look happy about this. He's going back through the hand, and of course, every hand he's seen Feldman play, not just today, but every time they've sat down. Trying to remember whether this kid from England would dare to take on the mighty powerhouse from Edison, New Jersey. 60,000. The river bet. And even though Tom Dwan's certainly got enough to cover it and then some, it's a lot of money. It's so much money. I don't think we're going to see a raise here, and if it's just a call, Feldman will know he's in front. Almost won't have to turn the cards over. Because it's taken Dwan this long to work it out. And the longer it takes, the happier the Englishman feels. Uh, 
I do believe Tom Dwan would be making a, quite a big error here in, in making a call on the river. He's almost convincing himself that he should call. It's funny, when Gus is convincing himself, he says it out loud. So we all know what's going on. But uh, Tom Dwan's a poker player, even when he's doing this. It's all done quietly. And there's not a lot of expression on that face. Andrew Feldman, 21 years old, showing a lot of maturity. Takes a lot of guts to keep firing at Tom Dwan. Well, I said there wasn't a lot of expression on Tom Dwan's face. I don't think I've ever seen him twitch so much. <laughs> he really is in agony about this call. Just shows you how much different cash game is to tournament. Every decision is truly about money. And look at that. Tom Dwan makes the call and he's not look at that. He he knows that he's behind. He makes a stubborn call and Andrew Feldman gets paid off. Finally he can breathe. <laughs> and why not when you just pulled in two hundred thousand dollars?